uh, they should leave the chessboard in the middle. If you left a chessboard in the middle, you guys, then I think maybe you could actually do it. You could actually fight against a real boxer because you could actually just run around the chessboard for like three minutes. Second. Let's they start with chess. Okay, let's watch this. Let's react to this. Give me one second. Where's my cam? Um, there we go. All right. Let me put myself here. All right, let me put the uh, chat. Where's, where's chat? Okay, let's watch this. Okay. This sound should be good. Tell me if it's too soft, you guys. Barring footage from both fighters, it's going to be close. Now, guys, I've played both of these guys, and I think we're going to get a London system, and we do. A London on the board. Amon's pet line. I've played about 20 times on well, the black okay. side of a Well, okay. First problem, where is the, um, where is the chess board? Where is the chess board on this? Shouldn't there be a chess board in a corner somewhere? Why is there no chess board here? First thing that I'm confused by, there's no chessboard, so I don't understand how people are supposed to follow. But let's keep going. London system, when I've played Amon Hamilton in Blitz games, I've played Lawrence a lot less. Already a very sharp position. Bishop has traded for the knight. And right off the bat, we are moving so much. It, did, it didn't, oh, it, it didn't work? Okay. Yeah, I'm just like, what is, what is this, uh, what is this opening? Faster than the other people. Okay. Anyway, you can see the board now, so, so it's not so bad. Than any of our other matches. Okay. So the, the experience in chess really coming through. Yeah, we have an early trade in the center. Very stable. This is going to be a very stable chess game. And very worth stable. noting that the coin flip was won by Amon, so he not only is a higher rated Coming chess in player first uh, in, in the uh, white also corner, Tyler, he also gets the Weighing white pieces. Is that a big advantage here, you think, Lobby? Not really, but he does get to a place of comfort. Wait, what was that? Oh, what was that? Um, oh, the audio on the clips is scuffed. Okay, <laughs> okay, <laughs> okay. All right. I was like, what the heck? Okay, let's keep going. Much faster. So they have played these two guys like a six-game match back in 2019. That's the last time they played any chess against each other. And Amon played three London systems against Lawrence then. He drew oh, no. twice and he lost Wait. one. But he lost that one on time. He was winning in that game. So he gets to a position of comfort. You see him moving quickly, confidently. He's got a nice position, good space advantage. Very easy moves get to be played in the London system. That's why a lot of people Coming like to play it. In the Coming white corner. <laughs> what the? <laughs> what is this? Okay, anyway, let's keep going. Okay, what the heck? Jeez. I'm sorry that, that okay. I, I don't know if that's intentional or not, that's really, really funny. Okay, let's keep going. About right. to get underway here, here in about 30 seconds, and that's really gonna be the difference maker. So I guess because Amon has played against Trent with this exact same opening and he's never lost it, maybe he doesn't have a good chance of checkmating and winning, but he has a much higher chance of not losing, not yes, getting And in terms of player styles, Amon is very stable and consistent. Lawrence can be erratic. He can throw attacks out of nowhere. Ooh, he very bad, very bad move playing D5 and allowing C5. So, like, actually, you know what's funny about this? Already, as I'm looking at this position, I think Lawrence is in trouble on the board before they even get to the boxing, which is kind of a problem, too. So he's, he's in trouble on the board, and then he has to box after this, and we, we know what happens. He takes a lot more risk. Yeah, D5 is a horrible move. Openings, horrible move. Openings, which by traditional standards are not very good. Look for Lawrence to actually start fighting, not just in the ring, but also on the chessboard. Lawrence is looking for something. Amon is squeezing him right now. Not physically, we're going to get to that. And the Arbiter stepping in. We have five seconds left on the clock. Amon has an They're early advantage stop, on the yeah. chessboard, but okay, here comes the boxing. Okay. And slight advantage on time to Lawrence Trent. Mm -hmm. Here we go. This is what it all comes down to. This is the big question mark between these okay. two. Gloves are coming on. It We're is, about to go at it. It's such a question mark, okay? Because, like, these two guys, I, I know them so well. I know there's a lot of folks here right now who support various streamers and much bigger influencers, but chess players, I've played both of them. I know both of them. And um, the last This commentary is killing me. I'm going to be honest. This commentary is killing me. We legitimately have oh. no idea. The only people that know how good they are are themselves and their coaches. They went radio silent. Didn't want to give any of that no. scouting information away. Yeah, Levy's way overdoing it. He's way overdoing uh, it. Not that I know. Anyway. Okay. Not that I know. <laughs> All right. So, so again, big question mark. All right, let's, let's see the box. This is going to determine the pace, the momentum. The, the rest of the chess game, this is, it all comes down to this. Mouth okay. pieces are going in, yeah. gloves are coming on. Oh my God. For I folks at home, we're doing gear checks. They're running with no headgear. We also have no... We're, we're they should leave the chessboard in the middle. If you left a chessboard in the middle, you guys, then I think maybe you could actually do it. You could actually fight against a real boxer because you could actually just run around the chessboard for like three minutes. Second, they they did the wear headgear or not? 90 seconds here. Now, I think the first two minutes looked amazing. Wait, wait, wait. I, I thought they wore headgear. They don't wear headgear here? Really? The chess uh. was played. Right. They played sharp. They played quick. I'm excited to see them play chess after this next 90 seconds. Yes, and I'm worried for it's them optional? because ah, they okay. will likely guess out. Like, that is okay, what we've seen a lot. I want to see straight punches, no slaps. Okay. At the, the break here. and stop. 
And in the ring right now, the man that has no slaps. more chess boxing matches than anyone else on the planet, Volfango Frizzi, the head of the Italian Chess yes. Boxing Federation and head of rules and regulations for the World Chess Boxing Organization. Oh, we start early. A nice, clean jab. Landed for oh! Big right hand. Oh! Big left hand. This is not what I expected. Coming up with a big flurry. Both landing shots. Oh, wow. Oh, oh, he's caught him. Still landing left and right is Amon. Lauren sneaking what? in jabs. Big shots landed for both fighters. So oh, another big oh! 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 oh my god, the first knockout of the match. Bofago giving the standing eight count for Lawrence Trent. Amon hyped as hell in his corner. That was a massive left hand from Amon Hamilton. We knew going in he was the better chess player, but I did not know and he was the better boxer. Back to business. Lawrence landing two jabs to keep Amon at bay. Amon's looking for the finish with 45 seconds Big on the clock. Landed. Halfway through the boxing round. No oh. defense to be seen from grapple, either. Lawrence grapples, comes to recover, separates, and back to action. All right, a little bit slower pace coming back. 30 seconds. They're going to be a little more tired right there at this point, Matt. Oh, a couple of big punches from Lawrence. Lawrence finds his distance, lands a clean cross right over the top, right on the chin of Amon. Oh, a good slip and counter right for Amon. Oh, he hurt him. Oh, the referee oh, steps in. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Second count. Oh, the fight's oh. over. It is all TKO. over. Amon TKO. Hamilton by TKO. And Master Amon. Wins over Lawrence Trent by TKO. And Lawrence is fuming. He's not happy with the rest decision. Unfortunately, so aggravated. out of our control. At the end of the day, talk to me about the ref, what they get to do, what they get to call. Yes, yeah, so much okay. momentum. Yeah, I mean, like, what, what to say about it? Like, I, I mean, yeah. My turn, no. I mean, like, yeah, the, it's like, I don't even know what to say, what to, what to say about it. What I would say, I mean, obviously, I'm not at any kind of boxing guy at all but it looks very clear that like even in form like Amon's fight like his punches are just better like it's not like Lawrence couldn't punch but Amon's punches just look like real punches at the end of the day that's what it looks like I mean no I mean we're chess players like of course we can't box but it looks like Amon's punches are like closer to being like real punches is what it looks like at the end of the day that, that's what it looks like if I'm not mistaken um but yeah, so anyway, not to, can I explain chess terms? Like I, I just explained what it is. It looks to me like, I mean, Amon's punches look real. They look like real punches. I mean, Lawrence's punches don't look like real punches. That's what it looks like.